Hi, I'm Dr. Glasper from Laser Skin Care Center. Today we're going to show a little demonstration of the V-Beam Perfecta Laser, which is used for treating uh, broken blood vessels, enlarged blood vessels, red birthmarks, general redness, rosacea. Uh, it is the gold standard best laser for this type of treatment. Today we have Robin who has a lot of small but enlarged and prominent red blood vessels. We're going to treat those with the laser. It selectively disrupts and um, uh, takes out the red blood vessels and uh, spares the skin. So it's selective, doesn't cause scabs or injury to the skin. It goes right through the skin and destroys the blood vessels. Sometimes leaves little tiny bruises, sometimes no bruises at all. Sometimes you see immediate disappearance of the veins and sometimes it takes a little longer. Someone like her has a lot of little scattered blood vessels, probably take two or three treatments. So uh, we're going to protect her eyes with the little um, shield here. And we have to protect our own eyes with the goggles. Laser light is very bright. And Olivia, I'll let you, you have some goggles ready to go. All right. And we're going to calibrate the laser. And let's see if it's ready to fire. It's ready to fire. OK. All right. Very closely. It's a little skinny, but uh, not, not very painful at all. Going to do a couple of pops here. You'll feel the sting. One, two, three. How was that? It was fine. Okay. No real bruising. It's like a good response. The vessels either turn a little dark right away or sometimes they just disappear immediately. I'm going to do several in a row. skin is very fair so it tolerates the laser well and we can use higher energy sometimes. How's the pain level? It's fine. Minimal? Zero. So the laser also puts out um, cold spray during the treatment so it keeps the skin cool and safe and it's comfortable for the patient. Calibrate again, do a few more pulses. All right. So she does get red afterwards, but there's no actual bruising. The redness disappears in a few hours usually. If you bruise, it can last a few days. I'm just going to do a whole bunch. Do some a little closer to the eye. These most fine small vessels are actually some of the hardest to treat because they're not as good of a target for the laser. But if you uh, get the settings right, you can get really good clearance. And the bigger the veins, the easier they go away. All right, I don't know how well this shows up on camera, but there's a lot of little ones here. So she's not bruising at all, which is good. She'll look normal tomorrow. Just a little bit red today. I don't want to treat too, too many in a close area because there may be a little swelling, so. That's pretty good. Do a few more on the chin and cheek, and I think that'll be it. And then you can kind of zoom in and show the redness, but um, 
You can see there's no actual bruising and no scabbing. Just a very gentle laser. Okay, now you may be able to just, just see the redness. Uh, I don't know if the camera's close enough to pick up that the little blood vessels are diminished or gone, and there's redness in their place. And that's it. Sometimes we'll ice the patient a little bit afterwards, and they're good to go.